Welcome back to Stark Tower, our base of operations. As soon as you're ready, head over to the briefing station for our next mission. If you like, take a break to chat with your teammates. Try the new sim console for training scenarios, or to run simulations of previous missions. You can also access the review terminal to study up on intel, or unwind with a trivia game. Well, I don't think we're going to be playing ourselves no trivia games. But this is the part where it's sort of like an intermission between uh, fights and missions and stuff. Where you can go around and get your nerd on and talking to other Marvel characters, which is a major liking for me. Except that you can't do web slinging inside Tony Stark's building. Apparently Iron Man is not a fan of the web slingers. But let's get our chat on. Now... I would use people like Juggernaut and Magneto, but they're not going to have any special dialogue because they are downloaded characters. So I am going to chat for this one with Spider-Man. What can I do for you? Hey, Widow, what's the time of the road? Anyone that's going to the city? Hey, Widow, so what brings you to Tony's humble abode? Nothing special. Shield likes to keep close contact with the superhero community. And since I straddle those two worlds, I bounce back and forth quite a bit. <laughs> Are you trying to make a joke with Straddle and bounce back and forth? Are you trying to give me some sort of nerd rage boner right now? <laughs> uh, but on your super spy, always good to have the help from someone extremely tight clothing. <laughs> Here with superheroes, no friction in it. Always good to have the help from someone extremely tight clothing. Thanks. Same to you. Well, I should have seen that one coming. So, is there any weirdness going on in the sea? Not really. Enjoy the silence. Rarely lasts. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna. Yeah, I guess you're right. Of course I am. Sorry, I have to get back to my work. Take care. Yeah, as I've said before in the past, that's mainly why I like Spider-Man because you still get the same answer off the person whatever option you choose but Spider-Man he just says it in a funnier way and also I like little tannoy bits in the background like that because you're walking around they announce things that are going on in the Marvel Universe and I'm not going to use any of these stuff because they are boring I mean just these talking to people is going to be boring enough but when you do happen to bump into somebody who um, you have a special dialogue with it will glow a certain color so what I normally like to do is just do a circle flick around all my people see no stars went around that so it's normal dialogue so if it's normal dialogue I talk with spider-man hail, hail to you so what's up with the gods it's not like you guys put out press releases or anything it'll have changed of late my father Odin continues to punish that vile Victor Von Doom and my brother Loki for their treachery of years past. Oh yeah, just uh, so you know, uh, I suppose I have to give you a history of the first Marvel Ultimate Alliance. But just so you know, uh, Victor Von Doom and Loki, they were the big bad guys that brought everyone together in the first place. And I'll talk a, bit, a little bit more about that later, but for now, let's carry on with this. Wait, everyone here says Doom's dead. Sounds like Doom's dead. Yeah. Wait, everyone here says Doom is dead. From a human perspective, that is probably most accurate. Hey, didn't you punch out Galactus a while back? Oh yeah, uh, the reason why they bring this up. Now let's just go with it first and I'll tell you after. Ah, well, a long tale, my friend. Best told over a good meal. I shall regale you with it another time, perhaps. Uh, if I if I were you, I'd be telling everybody. <laughs> yeah. Oh, come on. If I was you, I'd be telling everybody. Constantly. I'm sure you would, mortal. But now is not the time. Alas, I have other duties. Farewell. Farewell to you, good sir. Be happy with your red cape. Magneto has a purple cape. Juggernaut does not need a cape. Have you seen what my suit is made out of? I don't even need a condom. <laughs> and you've got to watch the Juggernaut bitch to understand any of these Juggernaut sayings I'm coming up with. 
But yeah, basically, uh, Victor Von Doom and Loki were the big bad guys in the first one, which made all the Marvel characters come together to try and beat him. And where the hell has Wolverine gone? Logan, get up here. But, um... And at the end of it, uh, halfway through the mission, you end up pissing off Galactus, who's the big eater of worlds, or devourer of worlds, I should say. And you're thinking the sequel was going to be about him, and then clearly they decided to make it about this instead. So that was like a little side bit, a kind of a joke almost, just to say, you know, hey guys, what happened? Because as I say, the Marvel community just as bitchy as the Call of Duty community can be sometimes. And a lot of people were moaning when this came out, hey, where's Galactus? He was getting angry at the end of the first one. So that's kind of a little joke, just to say, meh. Nah. Calm down, guys. So, my little circle of talkitude. No, circle of talkitude fouled. We will talk with Spider-Man. Hey, I know you are the new warriors, right? Not these days. Firestar and I graduated, so to speak. And the team's current direction, well, let's just say I don't have any interest in being part of a superhero reality show. <laughs> Right, that might actually be, you know, fun. I don't even watch the show. I can't. I just hope they don't do anything to really tarnish the name. <laughs> oh, I want to say something, but I don't want to spoil the game. Bloggers keep saying you did jail time. Crazy, huh? It's true. I used my powers against my dad to protect myself. It was wrong, and I willingly paid the price. Uh, ba -ba -ba -bom. <laughs> I hear prisons don't even have cable. My time in the vault wasn't as bad as you'd think, but I'll always wish I had found another way to deal with the situation. Sorry, I have to run. Take care. <laughs> I always think they put the ending bit like the sorry way too soon, because <laughs> it kind of interrupts themselves. And mate, you're not a part of my team. Stop running with my team. Go away. Yeah, you stand in the plant pot. You run. But um. Yeah, one thing I've always been a bit sour against is one time I've wanted to use a different character because obviously if I was to switch around my team right now, Spider-Man or Wolverine may be also standing in this thing and I could talk to them. And when I did that, I wanted to go back to one of these other guys and chat to them and I couldn't because I'd already talked to them with someone else. And it's a bit annoying, I do find, that once you've spoken to them, you can't re-speak to them. But I guess that's where they're wanting you to use your head and pick the right people to chat to them and yada, 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 yada. You don't really... There's nothing you can really get out of them other than little cutscenes that you wouldn't get with other people, you know. So it's just personal preference. And that's it. I think we've spoken to everyone there is to speak to. Other than probably Spider-Man and Wolverine if I was to switch them out. But which I'm not going to adjust yet. So what's this? Is that the mission? Next mission? Yeah, I don't want to do that yet. I th think I want to switch out my team. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I can't remember who it is. Is this the team switch? Nope. No, nope, okay, looks like I've got to report to the briefing station. Don't think I have an option at this point to switch my team. Okie dokie, let's go to the briefing station. I'll switch my team out later. Things have been pretty quiet around here lately. I suppose we should have known it was too good to last. Miss Marvel has been investigating an international gun running ring in the city. A lead identified this Roosevelt Island construction site as a front for their operations. And last night she reported discovering unexpected tunnels running beneath it. This morning she failed to check in. Carol can definitely take care of herself, but we'll need to follow up on this just in case. Let's start by investigating those tunnels. I feel I've just remembered how to switch your team out and it was actually back at that place. Because I remember last time I did this, I did it with a different team and I don't actually want to do it with this team right now. Which, in the, the risk of kind of ruining the playthroughness of it. No, nope, I can change my team now. Oh, that's, fan there. that's fantastic. And the team I'm going to be using for this is the Fantastic Four. We are using Mr. Fantastic. Come on. Load. Load, load, load your slow game. Yep. Oh, you get your stretch on. Place Magneto for the Invisible Woman. Oh, Game C, you know who I'm going to choose. You just know. You just know I'm choosing. You're fantastic like that. <laughs> yep and Spider-Man yes Spider-Man you are getting switched up Black Panther that is not true although I believe Black Panther is a form of team with them um, when they released DLC obviously downloadable content uh, and they released new characters you can download they also 
uh, increased teams because unlike normal teams like the X-Men, Fantastic Four, Avengers, stuff like that, you do also have uh, sub teams which are groups that get put together. So say for example, a team which isn't necessarily a team like, I don't know, if you chose like all girls on your team, uh, it'll be, I think it's called Femme Fetale or something like that. Uh, I can't remember the exact name for it. Where, have I just gone past him? Where, where are you? Ben Grimm, there you are, come on my team baby. But yeah, um, you can have little sub teams, like I believe if you have Mr. Fantastic, uh, Invisible Woman, Storm and Black Panther, it's called like Double Date or something really lame like that. And yeah, you have loads of other stuff, like you've got Heavy Hitters, you've got Juggernaut, Thing, Hulk and uh, I think it's Venom or Thor or something like that. They're called, oh no, it might be Luke Cage, they're called like the Heavy Hitters because they're all melee. Or Big Thinkers, you've got Iron Man, Mr. Fantastic, Peter Parker, Spider-Man. Or and somebody else who I'm forgetting. You know, it's just um, it's just little things like that. You know, and by choosing a team, you get extra things. Like for the Fantastic Four, you get 35 plus on your fusion game, and on other such stuff. I've just realised I forgot to do something. Equip my boosts, but on other teams you get different boosts. So um, it's kind of a <laughs> no. I am. <laughs> That's got to be got by Juggernaut. You just know it. But. Um, Fire attacks deal five more damage. That's what I want. Yeah, so different teams get different boosts according to who you've chose. You know, it's just the way it goes. There's one team I use for the later third of the game, and I say I pretty much use them for the entire game after that point. But um, fusion damage, that's always good. And what's my last one be? But yeah, until that point, I like to mix it up because I know for the later part of the game, I tend to. Oh, fifth resistant. Oh, that's resistant. I don't want that. For the later part of the game, I tend to use the same people consistently. So when it. Oh, is that all of them? It is. Okay, fair enough. So, fuck. Blah, blah, blah. One focus for faster stamina and refill. Now, I'm going to do it to 15% resistance to games. Now, that'll do. That's fine. Drain him. There we go. But, yeah. Uh, I, I just because I use them for the later part, I like to mix it up just because that way you get to use a variety of characters. Because you get all these characters and you just use the same people consistently, it's just it's completely lame and boring. And look at that, see, I love the human torch. This guy is freaking amazing. And plus, you've got Ben Grimm and you've got Mr. Fantastic and Susan Storm, and they are all effective. Mr. Fantastic, not so much. Ben, obviously, just a uh, melee and stuff like that, but you know. Sue Storm, she has got some great attacks, and so does Johnny Storm. So, um, yeah, but they are both Invisible Woman and uh, Johnny Storm. Both people I use quite a lot throughout this game. Let's see if there's anything back here before I continue. Nope, alright, there's roll. Do, do, do. Are there any bad guys actually going to be around here? Oi! What are you doing? Get out of my face, he's just like that, look. He's... Yep, and he and also he makes stupid little superhero quips just like Spider Man. And what can I say? I think I'm a bit old school with my heroes. Oh I say old school. Not really old school as such. Um, old school would be you know, the Captain America, the Iron Man, uh, the Wolverines, the big I am the hero, I am boss. I tend to be what I like to call in like wrestling terms the attitude era of uh, comic books, and that's when you get people like the Spider Man and the Fat and the uh, Ice Man and the uh, Human Torch and stuff like that pop up, where they're constantly just coming up with their quick quips and stuff like you always see on TV on kids' cartoons and stuff like that. They're always my favourite growing up, you know, like. If you're a rice man and you attack someone, you're like, oh, cool off, you know. <laughs> Those things, you know, as a kid used to just get me wet. <laughs> Which is probably a bad term to use, saying as a kid, but it is what it is. Uh, which way am I going? I'm going that way. So naturally, if I'm going that way, I go through here. Wee! You guys aren't supposed to be back here just yet, because this is supposed to be a secret way I'm going. Burn, baby. Burn. You ain't the Hulk. Uh, Benjamin Grimm. Activate. Oh, 
Oh, you do got it. That's it. Chug, chug through there. I don't think I'm supposed to be going this way just yet, but... Oh, wellity, wellity. I'm going to go this way anyway. Oh, no, that was it. It was just one power up. Let's roll. Flame on and all that jazz. Do, do, do. What's back here? Oh, no. That's just where I'm supposed to be going. All right, come on. Let's fly it. I'm not actually sure if you go any faster when you've got a character who's flying, but it certainly feels like you're going faster, so that's what I tend to do. Yeah, I know, I'm going that way. <laughs> I should have really used the thing for that, because I really doubt that he could have hit it that hard, but I like also doing stuff like this. You know, you can do that, and those boxes will fall on people and kill them. And I'm not sure if this guy's dead yet, so I'm just going to blow him up just in case. Throw some stuff down on some peoples. Let's pick him up, and I think it's... Oh, no. Uh, they used to have really cool, um, in the first one, if you grappled them and then did your circle attack, it would uh, do like, it would pick them up and throw a flame at them. It was pretty awesome, but obviously that's just the first one, that isn't this one. But whatever, you can't win them all, can you? As I say, it always blows, <laughs> I love that, look. <laughs> have that. <laughs> I love it, you blow that one open there's just a guy sitting on the toilet. You so you so scared of me. He actually crapped himself. I'm so I'm sorry, mate. There you go. Another McCran crystal, and just like that, we're on our way to get unlocking whoever the McCran crystal unlocks. I forget. Yeah, I have barrels fall on you. What? You're supposed to be dead. What, can I say? what are you cheating about? There you go, and down in the middle, and boom. Again, people uh, with long range attacks don't tend to be all that good with the melee attacks. Or melee, or however you want to say it. That's probably why their stamina heals up. Get off. That's why probably why their stamina heals up pretty good, and they don't tend to be that strong, unless you're talking about people like uh, Spider-Man and that. Well, whatever. You always want to get a good range of people on your team. The strong man, the, the long range man, the... And the funny man, just to keep it entertaining. And that's what stuff like the Fantastic Four and most teams tend to have, unless something like the heavy hitters, obviously. They're, they're just bolts of people. But let's do a clearing one. There you go. See, that's what you're looking at. Mr. Fantastic bashes them with his hands, and Johnny Storm clears them out. See, that doesn't sound like the Invisible Woman. The Invisible Woman's a mum. She's... A hottie, but she's a mum, especially if you count. And I'm not talking about the comic books before you troll me. I'm talking about the film, Jessica Alba. Love of my life, I'm just saying. <laughs> but, um, yeah, and to be honest, oh, damn it, there's a thing back there. I don't think I got it, but I will. But in this, she just sounds like a Sarah Michelle Geller to me. But that's just me. Get out of my way. What's this? Is this a smash thing? Well, just to keep the story better. It's going to be the thing if anyone's going to smash something. There we go. Boom. Quite literally, boom. Slightly, and I believe this is going to be a job for the thing. What are? The whole smash! Well, okay, the thing isn't doing it as well as I thought he would. Clearing. Let's get everyone out of it. That's it, Johnny Storm. You just blast him away. God damn, that's why you're my favourite. <laughs> At least out of the Fantastic Four, you're my favourite anyway. Blast some of these away. And just, he's just all powerful. Look at you, look. He just fires his fireballs at him and they are down. Down and out. Okay, maybe not quite out. There we go. Stop ruining my sayings. Let's roll. Oh, I believe we've got to go this way. See, that's where the other bit was just now. Let's blow up some boxes. Oh, God, there's one of these things in there. I was not expecting that. Let's go for clearing. Whoops. Clearing them out. Okay, looks like I've got to go down to do this. Clearing them out. There we go. Didn't get all the targets, but if you do manage to get every single target when you're doing one of those things, uh, you can get yourself a little health drop. 
which is always helpful, especially later on in the game where it does actually get quite a bit harder. And I believe I should have stuck this on Legendary, actually. I believe last time I played this, I played on Legendary. Uh, if I can bump up the game difficulty halfway through, I think I may do, because this, even though it is early stages, it, it's pretty easy right now. I mean, as you can tell, I'm just busting through. Kicking ass and taking names. So, whatever. Here we go. How much more of this you think you can take, hero? Now, don't keep telling me you came in here alone. Where are the others, huh? Right behind you. Come on. You really think... Oh. <laughs> Shocker. One of my one of my favourite bad guys in the Marvel Universe, but again, that'll be because he's a, a Spider-Man bad guy. And you know I love my Spider-Man bad guys. All right, let's let's do this thing, though. Oh, good lord, that's better. Right, all right, get long range attacks on. Where is he? Let's just fire fireballs at him from a distance. There you go. Well, and now, we, now I've now run out of mana or whatever you want, stamina or whatever you want to call it. Switch to Susan Storm. Lava, rinse, repeat. Classic. Boss fight. Standards. Whoa. And back to Johnny Storm. Oh. That's it. Let's blow up some of this stuff. Why not? Got fire. Re he's resistant to fire. Stand up tall. Fire fireballs. And I believe I have a targeted. No. That'll be the thing. Targeted. There we go. Where's Shocker? Fire up my rock. And on your face, Shocker. Boom. Like that, we're done. And I believe we finished with Thing, which is good, because I like the way he talks. You're gonna let me down or what? Yeah, in a minute. In a minute. Let me collect some stuff first, because I know you won't let me do it once I've let you out. So you, you just hang on, alright? <laughs> Have that, mate. Yeah, I'll be there in a second. Jesus Christ. You'd think that I hadn't just came down here to help her. Oh, another bad guy. What's the matter? Can't take the heat. Oh, funny jokes, funny jokes. Anyway, come on then. I like the way you say stuff, so let's do this thing. You won't get much farther without me. Shut up, my lord. Thanks. As you can probably tell, this op is a lot bigger than we thought. We need to figure out what these Latvarians are up to. That very last fury to pump them. Henry, yeah, the thing he's he's the big gentle giant, you know, the blue eyed the blue eyed thing. He's a nice guy, although, yeah, no, the thing would never back down. You look hurt. We'll take it from here. Appreciate the thought, but you have no idea where you're going. There's an old factory above these tunnels. If we destroy the weapons they've stockpiled there, it's bound to slow down their operation. Hokey pokey. Let's roll. Boom, boom, boom. I'm the thing. I will see it on your face. Oh, you campers. With their ghillie suits on. You just know. You just know they had ghillie suits on. As I would have found them the first time I came in here. Oh, no, you're not. Do you know why you're not? Because... Clearing! And just like this, with the OP fusion powers, you are taken down. 12 of 12, health boost. Thank you. And even though it doesn't really do much, just get up in the sky. That way, you don't get crossfire. If someone's shooting at you, they are shooting at you. And you don't get hit by somebody else's blast. Fire fireballs at them until you are no more. Thing. Get your Hulk smashing on. Susan Storm. Throw some enemies at each other. Like, and just like that. I think we're finished here. Into the mill. <laughs> Let's go. And here we are. To the exit. Um, before I take the exit. Oh yes, boring details. Uh, hero details. It is not auto spending my points. I knew it weren't. <sighs> Blaze fire pillar. 
because I'm not by that yet. Fair enough. Right. Oh, I spend. I forgot. I was thinking that I didn't think they were ranking up. New because they're new people. It's one of those annoying things that. Whoops, that isn't what I want to do. Because they're new people, you have to redo it every time the auto spend. You can't just set it as a standard. I mean, don't get me wrong. If you could set it as a standard, I'd probably be moaning that you set it and it happens to everyone. But it's nice to know that if you set your entire team, they should just stay as it. But whatever, whatever. That lead up to the factory. You go on ahead. I'm gonna finish exploring these tunnels to look for additional intel. If you need any help, I'll be ready. And just like that, I can pick Miss Marvel whenever I like to be on my team. I think I do at some point. I can't quite remember. I don't really feel like I'm in the mood for using Miss Marvel, to be honest with you. Not anytime soon, anyway. Not unless it tickles my fancy at some point in the future. But whatever. Norman Osborne, aka the Green Goblin, has plagued New York for years. Yes, he has, and driven Spider Man mad in the. In the process, yes, another one of Spider-Man's enemies, and more recently in Dark Reign, the world's enemies. I just love comics, they're so freaking amazing. And I don't care what you think, if you think it's nerdy, if you think it's this, if you think it's that, I freaking love it. I mean, later. Trash the Liberian weapons first. I mean, when it comes down to it, you're watching me play a video game on the internet, so for as nerdy as I may be, I don't think anyone here can really disagree that anyone here is more nerdy than somebody else because <laughs> we're all doing the same thing here after all whoops smash and let's see look again even though he's not the biggest guy just like spider-man he has the best power for destroying stuff ah blow that up all right oh i remember this bit Oh yeah, generic saying. See, and even though I just mocked it, stuff like that, I just love it. You know, he, he does flames and he says you're toast, yada yada yada. Just, <laughs> I just can't help but love it. It's stupid and it's childish, but I love it. Whoa! <laughs> I forgot I'm the only one that's immune to that fire. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Anyway. I'm sure the other lot will survive. They'll regen at some point. Oh, what's that? You want me to destroy ammunition and I can shoot fire out my hands, you say? And just like that, it is gone. Let's clear some of these enemies out. I don't think I'm going to get them all. I don't think they're all in my radius. No, they're not. Didn't think so. Anything up here I can see? And this is what I love about the tool rooms. You can circle the whole thing and decide where to go. Munitions. Let's take out these guys. What's up, dog? Whoa. What's up? Dude, number one. Dude, number two. And do number three, four, five, and six. You can get taken out by a massive explosion because I am immune to this. So just let it explode. How did you guys survive that? There we go. So weird. Where are we going next? Take that guy down. And that guy. Won't last very long either. Here we go, in here. Whoa! No, I thought I, I thought I had the fusion power left over, but I didn't. Oh well. Let's just get in here and blow this stuff up. Oh, now I have a fusion power. Whoa! There it goes. <laughs> Thing, why did you follow? What? Oh, you all followed me in here. You're crazy, the lot of you. Yep. Good. Destroy stuff. Where are we off to next? Directly below us. Okay. This was over the minute I flamed off. Oh, looks like I've already set it alight, so. 
Yeah, I knew it was going to be something in it. Ah, oh, it's just health. Don't need to worry about that. We've got two, or I think it's, I think it's three, or is it just two sets of health? And I know the other things back there, I'm just going around there to pick up other stuff that I know is around, like these bad guys. Stuff like this, here we go. Dump. Even though I don't really tend to use them all that much. Which I should do, really. And at some point I probably will, but right for now, I don't really use them that much. Let's sneak round the back door. Oh, it's a joke. It's a sexual joke. They're all going to blow up, so let's just move my team back and wait for them to blow up. There you go. That's that. You're right, there is. Where are we going? We're going that way. That way. Must be straight through there. Yep. Bad guy. That's a good sign. Nice no, round here, isn't it? Just around this corner, if I remember. Yep. Bad guy. Boom, baby! Oh, no. Oh, I prematurely boomed. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Thing, help her out. Right. Well done. Get back, team. Is it going to blow up? They all get health. Yeah, they all get health. Good, good. That was the last one. Where are the reinforcements? Up my bum. Okay. Getting a uh, blowing up here on. Yep. And unfortunately, guys, before I move on to the next bit, I'm going to have to cut that off here because I have to disappear. So we will carry this on next time as I give this one a quick save. Unfortunately, I have things and places I have to be right now so I'm going to have to leave this one at this point I'm sorry for the cliffhanger uh, let's create a new save and I'll pick it up next time but yeah that's been fun I feel, I feel I'm going to keep playing that because the, an hour and 40 minutes I've been playing for now and that time has just flown past so I'm going to have to leave it there for now and we'll pick it back up when I can so for now catch you later guys